stuff, but also decal for Americans. It's all over his body. Then he's got um, this pistol, I think it's... Oh, I can't remember what it is. But tell me if that's right, that pistol. And uh, moving on to the next one. This is a submachine gunner. Would it be a machine gunner or just a sub? Would it be a submachine gunner or a machine gunner? I don't know. I think it's a machine gunner. But it's got a PPSH and a Ush. Ushta? Ukta? I can't remember the name of that hat. But it's the Russian traditional hat, which a lot of um, Russian soldiers in like Stalingrad would wear. It's got pretty, um, kind of the same decal. It's still got the pouches and that on his legs. Got a very nice face, brilliant moustache. And um, yeah, that's pretty much all for him. Next one. We've got um, a sniper who has the same decal as the last one. And a uh, Russian sniper, which I also cannot remember the name of. It's got it's the exact same guy as another one because I bought two packs, but I can only find this from the other one. But um, yeah, same guy, so no need to review him. Well, we do, but we just won't review that one back there. Right, next machine gunner. He's got a different face, believe it or not. Wow. Um, here he is because he hasn't had a moustache. So. He's got a beard and the PPSH again. The same decal, so not much explanation needed. It's like the exact same, just a different face. Next one. And final one. It's the exact same guy who was a sniper but with a shovel. So, move on to the next one. We've got the British. I'm going to move those up because I don't want to show you what the Americans are because the Americans are special. By the way, do you know what that is back there? It's a different skin colour okay i know it's weird but starting at this end with my favourite soldier out of all of them um eh. okay he's dropped his gun that's always a good start so this is his gun i'll just show his gun separate it is is den no is it i think sten yeah not a bren it's a sten and you can actually take the clip out Minute, I'll just do that right now. Just a bit hard. Alright, the clip is out. Look, the clip is out. And then, one minute. Eh. You can put it back in. Like so. Sorry that my things are in the way. I'm recording this with my new phone. I'm not very good at recording with my phone yet. But yeah, that's his gun. And this is the actual minifigure himself. I really like his face as well, that's one of the main reasons. He's got a brilliant decal. And then he's got a body helmet. So, yeah, my favourite British one. Not my favourite out of all, but my favourite British one. Now for the sergeant. Some people call them sergeants. And no, it's, it's sergeant. I know it's spelled weird, but... So he's got, like, his cap and a revolver. Like, um, magnum or something, I don't know. Then a pair of binoculars and a different decal. Oh, I didn't show you the back decal. He's got that back decal and the other one had this back decal. Sorry about that. I'll just show you that. No. Oh. Just if you didn't see the decal. Oh. Got a kiss. Then right there. Um, and a brilliant moustache again. Moving over. Now, if you know why I'm talking with it's because I've got my knee against the bottom of my chin. Don't know why, it's just pretty comfortable. But um yeah. So this is the sniper. That face is amazing. <laughs> I was being pretty sarcastic there, but it's a really good figure. I just think the face is a bit funny. A really brilliant decal. There, my mouse my voice has changed for you there. Then he's got a backpack covering that decal. But it doesn't matter. And I actually painted that myself, if you can't tell. Painted that handle myself. And um, it has got a broader helmet. Moving on to the next one. This is the different skin coloured one. With um, with an RPG, like a bazooka. The German one is the Panzerfaust or the Panzertrek. Then it, it's got a broader helmet. And then it's got ammo going across his chest. And then it's got nothing on his back. But yeah, pretty cool figure. 
not my best, but it's cool. And a really good first decal. Uh, not decal, just a really good first. Sorry about that. Next one. On to just another soldier with a body helmet. This is a body helmet soldier with a beard and a moustache. A brilliant decal on front and on back. And then he's got a um, not as so good revolver, but it's still a pretty good revolver. Next. By the way, if you wonder where I get my weapons, I get them from the cams. All of these are from the cams, apart from this one. Okay. Now for my final, is a paratrooper. I had, uh, I think, one more, yeah. But, because sometimes, some, some of them don't have weapons. They, like, have knives. Some of them don't have anything. Because I can't fit them on the plate with the others. This is, he's got a knife and binoculars. A really nice beret, red beret. Um, a brilliant decal, just like the others. Like, no different, I don't think. Then a good face, like an angry face. <laughs> okay, now onto the special weapons. These are special. Because, yeah, they're the ones with a vehicle. They have a tank. So, these are my Americans. Probably my favourite armour. I don't know. It's a tie with my Germans, which you'll see in a minute. But this is a custom-made tank. I made it all by myself. That's why it's got that inside. But I made it all by myself. You can't see that there. So it's got a gun, and you take off the legs and sit them there. I did take inspiration from other YouTubers that I watched while I was just sat down, and I thought, you know what, I want a tank. So I made a tank um, all on my own. I'm really proud of it, actually. And it me why, but this bit moves. And it's got, and it moves itself as well. Because the trucks, which I took from an Indiana Jones um, set, which I got for my birthday. Now, on to my Americans. My favourite army, I think. I'm not sure. Well, you can just see a little sneak peek of the Germans there. I'm just going to move them. But, um, yeah. So this is my first American. A brilliant decal. He has one on the back, but you'll see that on another one, probably. Because he's got a backpack. A really nice grey pot helmet. And a Thompson. Yeah, I. this is why I like my Americans. They're really good. These are probably like Marines. Focus, please. There we go. These are probably like my Marines. Really good face as well. Forgot to mention. But these are probably like Marines. I have some infantry, but tell me in the comments if these are infantry or marines. Next we have a soldier, another American, which poss which is a possible marine. With a grey pot helmet and a beer beer, or I just call them bars. And then he's got and it's like kind of a and he looks a bit Scottish, don't say why. I know that probably sounds very mean just because of his face, but nice little decal on the back. Not the same as the last. I don't think any of them are the same. Apart from, yeah, none of them are the same, so sorry that you didn't get to see the other decal. But yeah, really nice minifigure. Um, yeah, so that was the second one. Third one, another possible marine. Um, with an M1 gland. And a grey pot helmet again. Good face, brilliant decal. Just like all of them have really good decals, I'm just saying. But, yeah, um... Grey pot helmet again, I don't think I said that. I'm pretty sure I did, didn't I? But, um, yeah. Next one. I think our final possible marine, apart from one more, which you, just pro which you can probably see in the background, but he has a bazooka, um, a grey pot helmet. I think it's like an M16 pot helmet. I don't know, because that's probably like a gun that I've got mixed up or something. So I'm not going to say that, I'm just going to say a grey pot helmet. So grey pot helmet, a good face. Another brilliant decal. Oh, that one's the same as the last one. But yeah. Sorry, I have really shaky hands. Like, look at how shaky I am. Sorry about that. But, um, next one. That was the second to last possible marine. This one is custom made. Apart from I took a few pieces from sets, like, that I bought. But I gave him my own face and hands and that. Um, he's got a Thompson. Yeah, I know I have shaky hands, I've said. I'll stop talking about shaky hands now. But uh, he has a green helmet, a, a, a brown backpack, a really nice torso, and some black gloves on. 
been a really good verse. Next one. This is my final possible movie. Possible movie. And you'll probably see what I made this of. Indiana Jones. And that's what I got. That's what set I got. It had those tracks and some of the building stuff and this and this Japanese guy. But it's got a sniper. And then the full Japanese outfit apart from a green pot helmet. Which I really like. Should I tell you what I need? I need some tan pot helmets. But yeah. Um yeah, next one I guess. Oh, uh, good soldier. God. I did have a Japanese collection, but mm, that one nowhere I don't think I don't have a clue. A really, really good soldier. Love this one. Um, aren't you just saw my Germans? RIP. But he's got a green pot helmet, I'm pretty sure. Green backpack. To um really good decal on front and back. And on his legs. Brilliant. Black gloves. A Thompson. And then, a, like, an angry war first. The eyes always look weird. Don't ask me why. In real life, they look cool. But they look, like, blue and... Oh, okay. <laughs> that was creepy. Um, second to last, American. This one, I just finished right now. Um, oh, crap. Sorry about my language. If I do that, it's just, like, my reaction. But it's got that Japanese cap. And an injured face, which I made injured myself i got this bad boy wherever it's gone if i if it's near me i'll show you here it is i use this and i gave him like a bust lip a bust lip uh, the lighting's very bad like a bust lip and like uh, a bust eye like a black eye maybe um and it's just made of a chic soldier star wars chic soldier probably one of my first soldiers that american soldiers that i ever had i just gave him this hat this morning before i made even before i even made my account um next um uh, final american he's just dropped his gun don't mind that but he has an m1 grand now i'll just draw that now and show you the figure another green pot helmet and a green backpack another decal that you can't see decals gloves and and like a really good face as well pretty sour um now on to my germans my biggest collection this one my americans had nine and a vehicle but this one has na um, nine and a dog so it pretty much classes as 10 in my books because my dog acts like a human yeah in my face reveal if i can hit one like i'll probably show him as well so we'll start at this end with the captain. By the way, some of these I got for Christmas. Not all of them, but most of them. So he's got a really nice Mauser pistol. I love the Mauser. It's like my favourite pistol. So I'm really happy about that. Really good decals. Like, look at this. Brilliant decals. Oh, an amazing face and an amazing decal on his cap as well. Just, an, just The Germans are amazing. I can't, they're just so good, I can't get over them. But, um, oh, let's keep moving. Just an injured face there. Don't mind that, look. Just an injured one. That again looks like a zombie. On my phone. Because of probably the light that it's giving off. If I can block the light, maybe it'll look a bit better. Because for some reason, when I'm recording, it turns on my light. Don't ask me why. Nah, that just looks weird now. Yeah, it's turned on my light for some reason. That's why it's so bright. Sorry about that. But now, the next one. A machine. One with a, a submachine gunner. I need to zoom through this because this is a really long video. Um, if you've made it this far, then well done. Uh, more brilliant decals and a backpack. MP40. Same helm. Same hat, pretty much. Like, same decal on his hat. 